small enterprise. So Machakos County Governor of Vinyandeti has directed County Devolution Executive Dr. Consolata Mutisia to ensure that all those who failed to turn up for the headcount during the verification of employees' details conducted by Human Resource Audit Task Force in November last year are expunged from the payroll. Governor Ndeti, while receiving report from four out of five task forces which she appointed in October, said all those who, whose biometrics were not verified should have been removed from the payroll and demanded proof that they were indeed removed from the payroll. As at November 2022, the county had a total of 6,321 staff, whereby 6,150 were verified during the headcount. Mumesikia. Mimi sitaki kufungwa. Tunaelewana. Mimi nitalipa ile ya ukwe. Ile isia ya ukwe li sitafanya nini. Sitalipa. Kwa hivyo kama mwatu waliendo wakafanya mambo yao, mimi hapo siko. Haya, watu wengine walifanya kazi kutoka 2013. Na wako na documents. Na imaji na wajalipa. Izashindia kitu moja. The task force ikuje, iangalie, tutengeneze yu maneno to set systems. You cannot play around. Umesikia maneno ya payroll. People are playing left, right and center with the payroll. Na payroll, ebu ni waulize, payroll ukienda, unaenda uko behind my back, behind unini, unaenda unaongeza watu. Ukiongeza hao watu, hao watu wanamaanisha lazima wafanya nini? Walipwe. Mimi nikipata mtu wako na ukora, utaenda nyumbani, unipeleke kotini, tutashinda kotini, I don't care and I'll prove myself. And a tough talking Machakos governor's uh, story that is uh, Ovinia Ndeti brings us to the end of uh, KTN. Uh, we can news KTN, we can uh, weekend prime actually. Sorry for that is the KTN news weekend prime. Asante Sana for joining us, our viewers. My name is Brenda Zeta Adira, sign language interpreter is Damian Evers to the men and the women behind the scene who made this uh, uh, news bulletin a success. Thank you. Good night. Enjoy the rest of your viewing. God bless.